Before you view our video, please take a moment to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button, then tapping the bell icon so that you will be the first to know when we post new videos. The lemon is a very versatile fruit that can be used both as a flavoring and in the preparation of desserts or juices. Several of its benefits come from the vitamins and minerals it contains, which strengthen our immune system and protect our liver, stomach, and skin from premature aging caused by free radicals. It's normal for us to throw away the peel of the lemon whenever we use it. What many people don't know is that half of the lemon's nutrients are in its peel. So whenever we throw away the peel, we are wasting nutrients that have many benefits, such as treating constipation, stimulating the intestines, detoxifying our body, protecting our organs from degenerative illnesses and infections, accelerating the scarring process, lowering swelling and blood pressure, helping to fight some types of cancer. Furthermore, the volatile essential oils in a lemon peel are very good at reducing joint pain since they relax the blood vessels and produce an anti-inflammatory effect that significantly lessens the feeling of pain. In this video, we are going to teach you how to make two different lemon-based home remedies that will rapidly help lessen joint pain. Recipe 1. Peel two whole lemons, any kind of lemon. Put the peel in a jar and cover it with a cup of extra virgin olive oil. Close the jar and let the mixture sit for two weeks in a cool, dark place. Then you can use the oil by applying it to any affected area and covering that area with gauze. Leave it on overnight. Always do this at night. On the next day, wash the area well with cold water. Test it first to ensure that you are not allergic by rubbing some on your elbow. Recipe 2. Grate the peel off of one lemon and be careful not to grate any of the white part of the lemon, just the green or yellow part. Rub the peel directly on the affected area and wrap a bandage around it. Let it stay on there for up to two hours. Always do this at night and wash the area with water on the next day. Test it first to ensure that you are not allergic by rubbing some on your elbow. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more recipes and tips, subscribe to the channel.